Thank you, Bobby Wine, for that decision. Otherwise, we have really been waiting for it for a long time. NUP suspended leaders in Busoga sub-region have appreciated Bobby Wine for the decision taken. So, what do you want to do? I want to do it with the people who are here. I want to do it with the people who are here. I want to do it with Busoga. I want to do it with Uganda. I want to do it with Uganda. I want to do it with Busoga. I want to do it with the people who are here. Okay? So, Police has confirmed the arrest of another terrorist in Kampala with a deadly mission to kill government officials. I'm coming up with the details. Uh, the Speaker of Parliament, Right Honorable Anita Mong, last night sent commandos in Mitana Municipality Member of Parliament, Honorable Francis Zakes home, and stole a lot of money. I'm coming up with the details. <laughs> well, thank you for keeping it the buzz, UG. And uh, my name is Mel Azmilo, a.k.a. Fula, as always. Uh, don't forget to contact Hajluzi Omsomi Wedua on that contact on your screen, and uh, he will get everything sorted. But also subscribe to the Buzz UG in case you haven't, and also tap on the bell for all the notifications. Now, before I take you to the main stories, there has been a prison break in northern Uganda, Pakwach district, and the security officers that side have mounted the search for the four inmates who escaped from lawful custody. However, Frank Baine, the spokesperson of Uganda prison, say one of the suspects has been arrested and currently they are hunting for three others. Members of the public have been requested to help security locate the escapees. Now, His Excellency Bobby Wine has exercised his powers as the president of National Unity Platform and suspended five of their leaders from the Busoga sub-region following internal wrangles which have tainted the party's image. These include Mr. Moses Bigirwa, Pastor Andrew Muanguzi, among others. And surprisingly, the suspended leaders have all agreed with what their president Bobby Wine has done so that the wrongs can first be settled. Obutabankobuno but I think this is a very wise decision. Even any that's a trick. The party secretary general David Luis Rubonkoya says the five portrayed a behavior contrary to provisions in their constitution. However, they have all been granted a right to be heard. <music> now, Mitiana Municipality Member of Parliament, Horrible Francis Zake, has revealed that his home was ransacked last evening, money and key documents stolen by government commandos. And he says they were sent by the Speaker of Parliament, Right Honorable Anita Among, and they also imbounded the commissioner vehicle he's been with, and this was in total disregard of the constitutional court case. Zake says uh, the commandos also searched his whole house, vandalized some of the property, and took off with an amount of money we are yet to confirm. Uh, yesterday, police confirmed the arrest of Muhammad Kayemba, a suspected terrorist, along Salama Road in Makindye. A Kampala Metropolitan Police spokesperson Patrick Onyango says they recovered an AK-47, three magazines with 88 rounds of ammunition and other materials used in making bombs. 
ebintu jeba jeba de bakujetwa zude nga bakozesa yokola chi yokola bomb kwa zude material ba jeba yita falcon waluo endala jeba yita sulfuric acid ne powder za njawulo waluo nitrate eh, lead nitrate Patrick Onyango also revealed that Kayemba had been sent to attack government officials, security, and other Ugandans in congested places. government government officials, Abatambulira mulunyiriri wa motoka oba ka convoy oba tasobodde okukuba abo agende mu kifochona eriwo jam akole akole chasoba kola chi okola However, some journalists requested to see the suspected terrorist Muhammad Kayemba, but police said nope, that's not going to be possible for security purposes. Well, there you go. That is the latest update on the Buzz UG this morning. And uh, I don't know what you think about these stories that I have for you right now on the Buzz UG. But in case you have anything on your mind, just put it down in the comment section. And also, don't forget to call that big man, Hajiluzi Omsomi Wedua. The number is on your screen. Call him right now and everything will be all right. My name is Mel Azmilo, a.k.a. Fula, and it's a bye for now. Thank you. Audio Jungle.